Hey, what's up everybody? It's Talos with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to save Android notifications and deal with them later. Now in this day and age, there's almost an expectation that you have to deal with messages as soon as you get them. But that's not always the best way to handle things. Sometimes you're preoccupied with something, and it would be better if you could deal with a new message when you have a chance to give it your full attention. With Android, as soon as you tap or dismiss the notification, it's gone forever. You either deal with it right then, or you probably end up forgetting about it. And this is why developer Moby Sock created a new app called Boomerang Notifications. It gives you a second chance to deal with notifications, and it makes the process as seamless as possible. The app itself is available for free on the Google Play Store, so search it by name and get it installed, or you can use the link in step one in my full tutorial. But when you first launch Boomerang Notifications, you'll get a quick little feature tour. You can go ahead and flip through this, and it's basically going to explain that when you either tap or dismiss a notification, this app will post a second notification asking if you'd like to save the first one for later. But when you get to the end here, make sure to agree with the terms of use, then you'll be prompted to grant the app notification access permission. So tap enable on this screen, then tick the box next to the boomerang entry here, and press allow or ok on the subsequent pop-up. From here, just head back to the app. Then you have the option of either using Boomerang on a per app basis or using it with every app on your phone. The first option is recommended, so leave that selected as it is, then press next. From here, you'll see a list of all your installed apps. Go ahead and scroll through these and make sure to tick the box next to any app where you want this functionality, then just press the back button when you're done. With that stuff taken care of though, you're ready to try out the new functionality. So the next time you get a notification, you can just treat it like you normally would. So either tap the notification to view it, or you can swipe it left or right to dismiss it. Immediately after you've done that though, you'll get a second notification. This one's from Boomerang. From here, you can either hit the save button to save a copy of the notification that can be viewed from Boomerang's main menu, or you can hit the save plus reminder button if you'd like to be notified about this message again later. When you do that, you'll be prompted to select a time frame. This is when the notification you just dismissed will pop back up a second time and the options here are pretty straightforward. After you've done that, just go about your day, and when the time comes, your notification will reappear. Technically, it's Boomerang reposting the second notification instead of the original app, but it has all the same details as the first notification, so you'll be ready to deal with that message when the time comes. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking.